Here we have the Gears of War 2 Perfect Active Reload and Rapid Fire Controller. This is the stealth version. As you can see, there are no added buttons to this controller. The controller appears to be completely unmodded from an outward appearance. There are nine modes on this controller. In modes 1 through 4, you have Rapid Fire and Active Reload turned on. You Rapid Fire using your right trigger and you Active Reload using your right bumper. In modes 5 through 8, your rapid fire is turned off, so now your trigger will just act as if act normal. And you still have active reload using your right bumper. In mode 9, both functions are turned off, and your controller will act as if it were unmodded. Now here's a quick demonstration in Gears of War 2 of each mode and what weapons it works with. In mode 1, it is set up for the hammer burst and the lancer assault rifle. Now here's a quick demonstration in Gears of War 2. Now to active reload, we just tap our right bumper. One more time. To change modes, we just tap our sync button and you'll see an LED indicator flash. It flashed twice, that means we are in mode 2. Mode 2 is set up for the pistol. Now here's a demonstration of the controller with the pistol in Gears of War 2. And the active reload. One more time. Now, change modes again. Flash three times, we are in mode 3. Mode 3 is set up for the shotgun. And one thing to know when using the shotgun you want to make sure that you let your guy completely cock the gun after shooting before hitting the active reload button. If you hit it too soon, your gun will jam. Now here's a demonstration of the controller with the shotgun in Gears of War 2. And now to active reload. One more time. Here's what it's like if you hit it too early. See how he jammed? Now, if we hit our sync button again, now we're in mode 4. In mode 4, you're set up for the sniper and the boom shot. Now, when using the sniper or the boom shot and you want to active reload, you have to shoot by using your active reload button. So. See, one more time. Shoot using your active reload button. Nope. Try again. See? Now change modes again. Tap in our sync button. We are now in mode 5. Our rapid fire is turned off. But our active reload is once again set up for the hammer burst and lancer assault rifle. As you can see, the gun is normal. Active reload. Nice. Now, sync the button again. Now we're set up for the pistol. As you can see, just normal. Active reload. Sync button again. Oh, we don't have a shotgun, but it's set up for the shotgun now. One way you can see is Shoot this. Should go a little bit longer. Now, sync button again. Now we're set up for the sniper again. Now for mode 9. Here in mode 9, both the active reload and the rapid fire should be turned off. As you can see, rapid fire is off. Now for active reload. See, active reload is off. The right bumper now acts normal. And then to switch back to mode one, just hit the sync button again. Now we're back to mode one with rapid fire on. And our active reload is back on. Nice. And this is how you use the Gears of War 2 perfect active reload and uh, rapid fire controller, our stealth version. You can find it on our website at www.getyourgamefix.com.